Inamin ni Liza Zubirano na marami ang nagulat at nasyak na magdesisyon siyang pumirma ng isang baguhang management agency noong nakaraang taon. Pumirma ng kontrata si Liza sa Curlis Whisper as the Curlis Music, ang music level at management company ni James Reed noong Honyo 2022. Hindi na nag-renew ng kontrata si Liza sa kanyang long-time manager na si Ogi Diaz. Gayun din si Star Magic, ang talent management arm ng ABS-CBN. Si Ogi at Star Magic ang naging susi para sumikat si Liza ng husto. Pero kapalit ng kanyang kasikatan, sinabi ni Liza na hinayaan daw niya ang ibang tao na magdesisyon sa kanyang showbiz career sa loob ng labintatong taon. Ito ang mismong dahilan kung bakit pumirma siya sa management ni James. I had been approached by so many different management before and it was the first time any of them had asked me what I wanted. What made me happy paliwanag ni Liza sa kanyang YouTube vlog February 26, 2023. I was finally given the choice to decide my own path, di niya. Kaya maraming tao ang nasyak at na-disappointed. Aminado si Liza na maraming na-dismaya sa kanyang desisyong magpalit ng management. Pangumpisal ni Liza na apektuhan siya dahil sa maraming sinabi ng iba dahil sa naging desisyon niya. Sabi niya, people were shocked when word got around that I signed up to a startup company. But what they didn't understand was that I chose a team that wanted to support my vision rather than laying one out for me. I struggled with how some people were disappointed and upset with my decision. I even started doubting myself. Many thoughts I had changed, but that wasn't change. It was in fact the first real choice I made myself for myself. Nagdetalye ang aktres upang ipaunawa sa mga taga-subaybay niya kung bakit mas pinili niyang desisyonan ang takbo ng kanyang karera. Dahil daw sa loob ng maraming taon, ibang tao ang nagdesisyon para sa kanya. I am 25 years old now and I think people forget that I've been working for 13 years now. Since I was 12 years old, I've been in six feature films over 500 episodes of teleseries and have only really doubled into three main genres romance, comedy, and drama. Since I was 16, I had only really worked side by side with one main co star with the same production company rotating around the same three directors. Sundot niya. During all those years, I was never really asked for my input, my thoughts, my ideas. Pano naman daw para gawin ang gusto niya para sa sarili kahit hindi pa puro ang ibang tao. Ayaw na raw niyang masunod kung ano ang gusto ng iba para sa kanya. I know I've been getting some backlash and I obviously know that it would be much easier to just stick to what has been working for me to stay forever the same. I know and I understand It's unfair to all the Liza Soberanos fans, all the Liza Queen love team with Enrique Hill fans. But I hope you understand that by doing so, by giving in to the pressure of doing what everybody else wants for me, I'm being unfair to myself, Hope Soberano, Anya, patukoy sa tunay niyang pangalan. I've sacrificed my childhood, I've sacrificed my freedom, and I've sacrificed my happiness to present Liza Soberano to the world. And I think I've earned the right to finally be me, so finally be able to do things for me as Hope Soberano. I've embarked on a fresh new chapter and I'm finally taking control of my life, pursuing dreams that I've always had a hold of on. It's exciting, it's terrifying, it's anxiety-filled and it's confusing. But what I know for sure is that for the first time, I'm finally living my life for me. Samantala, Isang pro ABS-CBN entertainment vlog na naglabas ng art card na kinontra ang naging statement ni Liza sa kanyang recent YouTube video. May titulo itong Liza vs. Liza dahil sa contradiction sa sinabi ni Liza sa kanyang recent YouTube video kumpara sa sinabi niya taong 2019. Binigyan diin sa art card ang recent statement ni Liza na sa itinagal ng kanyang showbiz career, I was never really asked for my input, my thoughts, my ideas. I felt like I was being told to be just a flower for so long and I finally started to explore a world of being able to create and tell my story and hopefully others. Sa pahayag ni Liza noong 2019, sinabi niyang tinanong siya noon ni Olivia Lamasan, creative head ng Star Cinema, 
kung nais nilang maipariya sa ibang aktor. Nais ipunto ng art card na taliwas ang 2019 statement ni Liza sa 2023 statement niya na hindi siya tinanong sa kanyang opinion pagdating sa trabaho. Ani Liza, noong 2019, they were like asking us, sina Inang Olivia Lamasan, are you guys open to work with others actors and actresses in the future? Well, kayo na po ang bahalang magbigay ng interpretasyon sa kanyang statement taong 2019 at taong 2023.